Hey, Karai, what are you doing? <laughs> She's learning Portuguese, the bad words. Well, it's a, what is it, Wednesday? Wednesday afternoon, Michelle just got home. Uh, I've been working for a couple hours on uh, different things, some touch-up work. This door, the passenger side door, had some flaked paint. I guess it flaked away years ago and somebody tried to just throw some paint over it and it was all flaking off. It was awful. So, the interior came out so nice that we really can't leave it like that. You know, it was really noticeable. So what I'm doing now, a little attention, attention to detail is, I'm, uh, you know, little imperfections, little bumps and stumps, you know, little things that are protruding that I can see with my hands and stuff. Feel with my hands and see with my eyes. And uh, we just masked the whole thing off with some brown bags we got, you know, from shopping. We saved them for this. With some blue painter's tape, knocked it out. Now it's all secure and uh, covered up without taking all the fixtures off, you know. And Michelle's going to be shaking the can of paint in a little bit for me, the black semi-gloss paint. And then we're going to, from this end this way, working inside out. So all the residual spray goes this way. And we're going to lightly do a thin coat, complete but thin coat over here, like a little horseshoe. Then we're going to let it dry about 15 and then we're going to do a second coat. And it should look really, really nice. It's really, really smooth and uh, it should look really acceptable, just like the other side. The other side looks pretty nice, the driver's side. I guess there never was a problem over there. Maybe back in the day, some mechanic or somebody at home spilled some cleaning product or something and it went down the side of the door and messed up the paint. They tried to buy a little can of model paint or something and spray paint it on there. Some some cheap 89 cents Walmart paint. I'm not sure what happened on that, but definitely wasn't a correct type of repair. So here it Johnny Bravo or Johnny and Michelle Bravo's Shady Tree Mechanic Emporium. We do things correctly, right, Michelle? Hopefully. What say you, Michelle? What say you? <laughs> Hopefully you did it the right way. There's no Joe Biden wannabes in this shop. But, uh, Leave the old man alone. <laughs> yeah, I know, poor thing. Kick a man while he's down, well, almost down when he tripped on that stairway, stairwell going up to the plane. Tripped three times, that was unbelievable. Jesus. How old do you have to be before you don't want to run the country no more? I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, that's just our fun, fun, funning around opinion. Hopefully he does his best, you know. Uh... Can't blame a guy for that. Let him try his best. They didn't give they didn't give Trump a chance, but hopefully he'll get a chance to do his do his best, you know. Yeah, there's a little Let's little see bit. See what happens. A little bit of little bit of imperfection. Well, I can feel it. If I can feel it, it's not right. Now, of course, once you put the paint, nobody's gonna see this, but I don't know what it is with me. I just always been that way, you know. Is like, something leaking? Cause look at underneath. Check it out later. I did start it up today for a few minutes. Yeah, I don't know, Michelle. Check it out later. Right now I'm concentrating on this. I hate to go run over there. You know what I mean? As you can see, it's nice and clean. The towel comes back white. That means there's no dust or shit molecules or unauthorized crud like in the military this thing's ready for inspection speaking of shit molecule i need to dump something <laughs> i need to dump out need to dump out <laughs> <laughs> she's gonna take over <laughs> goodbye all right bye for now take care <laughs>